Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some Enlightened. Uh, this is their Keto collection, and they were actually kind enough to send these to Kevin and I free uh, for us to try. So, I don't know what flavors they have in their Keto collection, but these are the ones that they selected for us. Uh, they sent us the Chocolate Glazed Donut. And they have coffee and cream. So these are, uh, it says one grams net carbs. It's one pint, no sugar added. It says 11 grams of carbs, minus two grams of fiber, minus eight grams of sugar alcohol, equals one gram of net carbs. They're gluten-free. Uh, they are produced in the Bronx, New York. Half a cup is 180 so calories. So many servings in there? There are four servings. So 180 calories times four? Right. Okay. So it says it's not a low calorie food. Right. It says for maximum deliciousness, set your pint out for ten, uh, for five to 10 minutes before digging in. It's worth the wait. We already knew that. If you didn't know that, uh, it would probably catch you off guard because you need to wait. Yeah, you'd walk uh, in there ready to eat and you're like, ah, I can't eat it. Yeah. Because so, they're hard. They're too hard to eat. Yes, you want to show that swirl. Just to make sure it's not too soft. So we have had these sit it, sitting out for probably 15? 15 minutes, yeah. No, that softened up really good. Yes, it did. It's still a big wow. hunk, though. I'm just going to eat out of the container. So there's plenty in there. So this is chocolate glazed, chocolate glazed donut. Yeah, I'm just going to be a caveman and eat it right out of the container. Did you get a big hunk of chocolate? Oh, yeah. I like the chocolate. Mm hmm. I like the um, I like the the way that they did the donut flavor because mm. you know what? It does leave a little bit of an aftertaste. I was gonna say, does it taste kind of medicine-y? No, it doesn't taste medicine-y. It, but it does leave a little bit of an aftertaste. It's the chocolate that has that flavor. Mm hmm. But I like the way they did the donut. We had it's some. Really good donut flavor. You don't? I think it's the vanilla in it. It is a, it's a strong vanilla flavor. But to me, that translates as the donut part of it. I guess so. And I just, I think they did a good job with it. It has a, it's not medicine. -y. It's almost, um, I want to say medicine, -y, but it's more alcoholish. Like there's an alcohol. In but it still is firm. I mean, it's even good, after though. being out for 15 minutes, it's it still is like firm. A big hunk. So you can also, if you know you're gonna eat the whole container, you can put it in the microwave for a few seconds, and it'll work uh, that way as well. But you prefer to get it almost right out of the freezer mm -hmm. and like chip away a little bit at a time that it lasts longer. Because I want it to last as yeah. long as possible. So everybody eats it a little different. Just yes. know that there's many many uh, different, different ways. Yes, absolutely. I like that, but it mm -hmm. does have that alcohol kind of medicine-y kind of flavor. So I don't know if I would get it. I think it's not bad. I like it. I think it's good. Even though, even though I'm saying it has that aftertaste, it's still not bad. It's right. still really you good. You still like I it. I still like it. Yeah. Yeah. He, he seems like... It's strange, but I still like yeah, it. Yeah, <laughs> it's different, but I like it. Um, okay, so this is the coffee and cream, and I think it's the same. No, this is 170 calories, uh, but it still has one gram of net carbs. So if um, if you are doing keto, it says, feel good fact, holding hands can help reduce stress. Did this one say anything? Oh, it does. Feel good fact, all over the world, goats help fight forest fires by snacking on dry brush is that, did you get rid of it i guess did you know that well i mean that makes that. sense but. i did not know that that is an odd fact and holding hands helps reduce stress um i've heard that before i've also heard that it's um pets that pets are really good for um relieving stress Actually, have guido he causes stress it could, 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 Guido is 15 years old. He'll be 16 this summer. Yeah. And he, he's old and crotchety. He causes more stress. He does, he in fact. <laughs> he, it, he's gotten to the point where he does cause stress. <laughs> it's nothing really to look at except just a coffee. Yeah. Coffee that's color. That's horrible to say, but that's the truth. <laughs> truth. Truth. <laughs> okay. Coffee and cream. 
Mm, that's a nice coffee flavor. It's strong. I like strong coffee. Mm. It is but I get that creamy strong. flavor too though. Yes. It's like a coffee with cream, but not all sugar. Christina would love this because Christina, it's I mean, almost I like, like an espresso. Mm -hmm. It's good. I like it. I like it, but it doesn't have that aftertaste like the other one did. Right. I still like the other so I one like though, it because I do like that vanilla flavor. I tell you what, okay. going from that one to that one, I like them both a lot for what they are, but after you've had the coffee one and you go back, which you're never going to do this at home. Who's going to do that? Unless you, you're both eating. Yeah, you're not going to do that. But once you've gone from the coffee and you go back to that donut, it, that is 10 Super times sweet. sweeter. I'm sure yes. it is. It is much sweeter than the coffee. But now, I like them both. Yeah, I do too. I think these I would, are very I good. personally would pick the coffee because that just has that little bit of aftertaste for me. Right. But, um, but if it didn't have the aftertaste, I would eat that one. Does mm -hmm. that make sense? Mm-hmm. It is in the chocolate though. It, yeah, it's in the chocolate because I got a hunk of chocolate at the very beginning. You're right. And it has kind of a... It's... it's um. Does it not taste medicine-y to you or a little alcoholic or... It's a chemical. Yeah, it definitely has it's a... It's a chemical, but it, it's not medicine, but it is a chemical. But the majority of what you're getting in there anyway is the vanilla. Yeah. And if you mix it with the ice cream, it's not as bad. Exactly. And so I do like it in conjunction with the vanilla. It's really, really good. Um, so either one of these, it just depends on you need to really like coffee though to get that. Yeah, oh yeah, you wouldn't get that unless you like coffee. It is over the top, super strong uh, oh. coffee. Yes, that, if you had that in the morning, that's gonna wake you up. <laughs> you uh, seem to. What yeah, <laughs> I don't know if you want that before going to bed because you're gonna be like. Um, but these are both really, really good. You know, we always tell you the absolute truth even though the company sent them to us uh, we would let you know if we didn't like them mm -hmm. uh, so i hope you all enjoyed the video i'll have a picture for you at the end and thanks for watching